Thank you, gentlemen. For the past two years, my next guest has been the world pocket billiards champion. He is also one of the most popular athletes ever to appear in a Miller Lite beer commercial. Please welcome Mr. Steve Miserak. Steve, nice to have you here. Thank you, thank you. How are you, sir? Two, two years in a row, you've been the pocket billiards champion. Right. Whom did you defeat last time? Everybody. No, nobody even close, huh? Nobody even close. Now, when you're playing for the world championship, what, what is the form of competition? What's the game? We play straight pool, 14-1 to 150 points. I don't know what that means. Straight pool is what? Every ball you sink, you get one point. You don't have to go one, two, three, four, five, no, six, no, seven, eight, no, just any no. of them. What, what's the other kind of pool? Eight ball, nine ball, whatever else you want to invent. Yeah, okay. What are we going to do here tonight? We're going to do some trick shots, David. All right. And I'm going to get you involved, and we're going to just sh show some of the people uh, what to do. Okay. When did you start doing this, by the way, for uh, professionally? I started when I was four. Four? Four. Now, how, how is that, that a four-year-old kid gets I was this tall. Yeah. The, my father built the floor up so I could see. Did you, you had a pool a table in your basement? Yeah. or? Oh, I see. Uh, I'm going to show you some very quick, some very simple shots, and then you're going to do one. All right. Okay? We start by putting the one ball and the cue ball like this, and it looks like you don't have a shot. You do have a shot. You play the one ball in here. Okay. It's a very simple shot. Just like that. You only play that if you're playing somebody a little bit smaller than you are. Now, have you ever, have you ever done that in competition? That's illegal. Oh. That's so why you play it if you're playing somebody don't wanna, smaller than you don't are. You want to do that in competition. Okay. Uh, I will take the 7 and the 15. We put two balls like this. Now, why was that illegal? Because it's a push shot. Oh. You take your cue stick and you place it on the ball and you push through. Instead of making the one along the rail this time, we make the one in the middle, the 7 ball. This one's also illegal. Yeah. Just like that. Very nice. Legal. And you get tired of making it in this pocket. Mm -hmm. Play it back here in this pocket. Okay, now this one is legal. This one's legal. I get three tries on all of now, now, <laughs> now, how did you know that wasn't going in there? It looked good to me. Now. Now, that looked... It looked... That's legal. That one was legal. Have you, have you ever played before? A little bit, not much. You for know, the, here and there, in for prison those, primarily. For those people, <laughs> for those people who, have, who have played in, in taverns, they play eight ball. They yeah. call it stripes and solids. And the 13 and the 8 in my hand. Okay. We put the 11 and 13 here. And my object here is to make the 11 and 13 go in this pocket without making the 8. All right. Watch what happens. Again, now, is this a, a, a good shot? No. You I can't have, do this one either. I do everything. Almost illegal. Okay, this is another one on the sly here. Now, you saw what happened. You saw what happened. I made the two end ones. Yep. This time, we're going to reverse and make the one in the middle without making the end ones. You want a beer or anything, Steve? <laughs> if I miss a few more of these, I'll need one. Believe All right. Me. The eight ball. I guess, I guess that didn't go in. I, I didn't see it. I'll get I, even with no, you. No, no, we're just, you know, trying to have fun here. Is this a special cue you're using? This cue is worth about $3,000. No kidding. That's nope. why you've got... Now, what is this one worth? I've got this. This is a Louisville slugger. I guess it would <laughs> probably be a little less expensive. Why? Now, why is yours worth three grand? Because the, partly because it's mine. <laughs> Second of all, because the guy who made it died, uh -huh. and he, you can't get him anymore. Is this made out of some rare wood or something? No, it, it's the Stradivarius, the pool cubes. I see. And a very uh, ha finely crafted right. piece right. of... And there's uh, inlaid little, little pearl and little yeah. jewelry okay. and a few other things. All right. Eight ball. Trying it again, huh? Okay. <laughs> How are we doing? Okay. I'm going to do one more. And then I'm going to set up one for you. All right. We do one more. We'll do a commercial, and then we'll come back, and we'll do the others. Okay. Okay, Steve. Nine ball, straight up the rail, and making it go in this side part. Okay. Again, illegal? Whatever you want. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Very nice. We, uh, we got to do a commercial, Steve. We'll be right back. We've got a lot more stuff to show you. Come on back, folks. Hi there. Steve 
Miserac, before we do this, what's the what's the most money you've won playing pool? Can you tell me that? Is the IRS? Uh, no, oh, okay. no. Uh, oh, somewhere's around fifteen, twenty thousand dollars. It's a lot of dough. One one game, one shot, one match. What was it? Three days. Three days. What's the biggest amount you've ever seen wagered that you maybe not were not a part of? Three hundred thousand dollars. Oh my! <laughs> Who was involved with that? Well. Uh, Three hundred thousand dollars. Okay, all right. <laughs> what are we gonna do here, Steve? What I want you to do is I want you to make the ten, the six, the four, and the three all go in that side right. pocket, and the fourteen in this pocket. Okay. We could use the thing that sucks the salad here. I think. <laughs> Hook that to the Remember, table. Remember, I'll let three you grand. use this. All right. Three grand. Okay. Um, I don't even I don't even know what. Uh... Okay. Let's let's help you out a little bit. Put it right here. Hit the edge right here. You know, fairly gently. I told a guy to hit it gently one time. He smashed his rack into smithereens. Gently, eh? Gently. Whoa. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> what I do wrong? It was almost about 98 percent. All huh? right, let's move on. Okay. <laughs> we might be here for a week if you tried to make it. To... We're going to do a shot with three cues. Now, this one is legal. <laughs> I need three balls. Now, what was, this is not the one you did in the, in the beer commercial, is it? No, no. Can that, you show us that one when we're done with this one? That one took me eight and a half hours and 181 takes. Oh, my. We don't have enough uh, tape, I don't think, for that one. You, don't, you couldn't even try that tonight? I've got a special one lined up. Okay. Now, what, is, what does that do? That puts holes in the table. What actually puts little uh, dimples in the filter? Yeah. Okay. If you have a table in your house, don't do that. No. Go to your neighbor's house and do that. <laughs> now, what I'm, <laughs> what I'm going to try to do is make the two ball here, the nine ball on the side, and watch what happens to the cue ball. All right. Keep your eye on the cue ball. <laughs> What's so funny? It's, it's just the band. It, it's, it doesn't have to be funny. It's the band. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. No. No. Very, very nice. Very nice. David, I, I've got a special one for you. All right. Turn around. Okay. Right here. Turn around. I did. I just turned around. I believe you're in. Sit up here. All right. Okay, a little bit. Oh, no. me. That's good. I don't want to mess up my jacket. <laughs> now, lean back. I've seen Marines do something like lean this. Right? A little bit more, about three more inches. Okay, now to me. It's closer to me, this way. Okay. Now, what I'm going to... is right here, so if we just take some x-rays, it would, from here... <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a... <laughs> oh, my. I'm going to put a uh, chalk in your mouth. Okay. And I'm going to balance the ball on the chalk. All right. And I'm going to shoot it out of your mouth from the cue ball on top of the rail 90 miles an hour into the corner pocket. <laughs> Did I, did I show you this thing that sucks lettuce? Uh... Now, I've only done this three times in my entire no, life. No, you haven't. You've been doing it for years, right? No. Oh. The, the, first, the first time I did it, I hit the guy right here. He only bled for 15 minutes. Now, now. The second time, I hit the guy right in the nose. But with, with your nose right now in that condition, it wouldn't matter anyway. <laughs> And the third time, when I opened the guy's mouth, now the bite on the chalk, he opened it too wide and he swallowed the chalk. We had to rush him to the hospital. These are all good stories, Steve. Just open up, Dick. Uh -huh. you, got a, you got a few cavities in there. Yeah. Bite on it. Uh, that's it. Now put the teeth around. Okay. Now if you shake too much, uh -huh. I'm going to bust your face up and piss a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Uh, is it hard here? Don't move. Are you on a drum roll? No. Drum roll. Drum roll. No. Wait a minute. Oh, come on, just do it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's cute. Thank you.